Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Minin and today here we are in Bee Storm Simulator Beesmas Edition. That is right, as you can tell right behind me, we are joined by two people, a person named Pumpkin Eye and my friend Death, who is uh, paying for this server, so thank you because I'm a broke boy right now. Oh, and there we go, we got a snowflake. But yeah, oh, and there's the new ability of uh, <laughs> Bouillon P. Um, but here we are, ladies and gentlemen, joined here once again. We are here in Beesmas 2021. Yes, that is right. Here we are, my first Beesmas. And I have to say, I love it already. It, the, the map, it just looks really amazing. A Christmas tree back there. We have two new mythics, the, bu the blue Bouillon Bee and the red Precise Bee. The UI looks different. As you can tell, our passives are down here. And our gear is here. Our boosts are up here. And uh, we also have a way to separate the type of beast we have. So as you can see, common, you can see common, rare, you know, epic, legendary bees, and uh, finally, mythic bees. So we have that going, which I think is very good because now we can tell which ones are different and whatnot. Uh, uh, I believe also some of these uh, passives might have changed. I believe some of them might have changed. I think. Yeah, Rose is red field capacity. Pine tree is blue field capacity. Um, Stump Edge is palm from tool, so that's great to have. Um, but yeah. We also have two new packs in the shop. The Bouillant pack, which is 800 Robux, and the Precise pack. More packs will be coming along the way. And do not fear, for I will be making a video buying all of them. That's right. So the reason for the lack of up for me not uploading on, well, I mean, today I was supposed to upload today is because I'm working right now. Um, my last day sh is on Thursday, so, and I'm gonna get, uh, and I'm gonna get money, so do not fear. The video for you guys uh, showing uh, if it's worth buying it, uh, worth buying the, uh, the packs will come. I will show you guys and we'll have a good time. But yeah, anywho, today what we're gonna be doing is today we're gonna be starting it off um, by finally doing uh, Beastmas. We're gonna go to the NPCs, we're gonna accept their quests, and uh, I'm just gonna show you guys a little bit around. Uh, I'm new to this thing, I opted to not really learn a lot about what's going on in Beastmas because I want it to be an experience for myself. So, um, yeah. But anywho, we're gonna talk to the man, the myth, the legend, Bee Bear, because I don't have a bee quip. Yeah, I, I, I've grinded for months. This is my first bee and we don't have a bee, a bee uh, clip case. So here we are. Anywho, anywho, let us talk to Bee Bear. <clears throat> ho 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 ho! Well, wouldn't you know? It's me, Bee Bear, the magical gift-giving honeyday bear, here to celebrate the most wonderful time of the year. Beesmas, a joyous season of snow, gifts, and most of all, bees. I've brought along my festive bee, my reindeer puppy bee, and of course, my cub buddies. Ho ho! Say, will you help us jolly this jolly up this map? Let's make it merry. If you complete five quests, I'll give you a star jelly. If you complete ten quests, I'll give you some goodies, including a festive planter, which is a new thing. Planters are a new thing alongside nectar. And three super smoothies. Oh, interesting. Not bad. And if you help me complete 15 quests, I'll give you a cub buddy of your own. So the cub buddy skin, which I will be getting. Or a star treat if you've already got one. One cub helper per person. Ho ho. Dang it. I wish I got it, but I didn't get, get it last beastmas. So free star treat to whoever you guys... If you guys already have them, you get a free star treat. And that's not all. Oh no, ho ho, I have even more gifts for you hitting around the map. If you help the other bears around the map decorate for Beesmas, you can open. You can open? You can open them, I'm guessing. What do you say? Are you ready to get festive? Your bees look ready. Let's not make them wait any longer. Collect 1,000 red pollen and 500 pollen from the mushroom field and clover field. And the first quest, bringing on Beesmas. So this is easy, it's it's the most simplest of quests. The quests usually start off easy, but they do get harder over time. So a thousand red pollen, again, it's... <laughs> it's not hard. Oh my god, that was just two clicks. Two measly clicks, and I'm already done. Oh, I'm beautiful. Um, <laughs> I didn't 
didn't even click my boots just <laughs> oh my god that's cooked oh i love being late game all right here we go let's do this talk to b bear Ooh, -hoo -hoo, that's what i'm talking about you and your bees make a fan make fantastic additions to my team of honey day helpers we've got so much more to do but here's some rewards including three paper planters oh <gasps> Set a plant in the flower field and it will automatically go over time while you're in game. Your bees will sip nectar from it, which grants you special boosts. Every time you sip from the planter, it speeds up the growth. There's a pu there's a pus room. That's the newest thing. Once the plant is fully grown, it's ready to harvest. When harvested, planters grant you pollen, nectar, and random rewards. So he's in, so he's explaining uh, planters and whatnot. The rewards change based on on the field you planted in. How exciting! Oh, ho, ho. please do try one out. Then talk to me again when you're ready for your next quest. Just four more for a star jelly, 14 more for a cub buddy, or a star tree if you already have one. Alright, nice. Yeah, great. Alright, we got world gigs, whatever. Alright, let's try this. So this is a push room, so I think you have to constantly plant it. Wait, what the fr Whoa! Whoa, 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 what the? Did you guys see that? It was like a ball or something. What the? All right, I'm going on this field. There's a bunch of push rooms here. All right, let's go. Whoa, there's a... Whoa, the mushrooms kind of just, like, go there. Nine, 970 million, are you kidding me? I'm not doing that. Oh, and as you can see, they give you a bit of rewards. Oh, interesting. Interesting. And you have to kind of be around them to, uh, to be able to get the stuff. Okay, I see here. I see. Also, did my festive gifts for my festive be bought, got buffed? Okay, what the? What is going on? So it moves from field to field? This is a million! Oh, wait, I thought it was a billion. I was like, oh crap. No, it's not a lot. So this is a level 10 push room. So we're gonna see how high we can get this thing. I just realized it's asking me for a million, so this is gonna take a while. Um, but yeah, these are the new things, so I guess they spread from field to field? This is interesting. So yeah, here's a bunch of- <gasps> Uh-oh, here's a bunch of push rooms. No, stop. I want to collect you all. Okay, there we go. Alright, so you get rewards when you plant them, and I guess they move towards other fields? So obviously you gotta pollinate them before the, uh, the timer runs out, so it's like two minutes right now. So we're just gonna continue. I think we got, yep, we got a neon berry, got sunflower seeds, we're getting gumdrops. Oh. Oh. Oh, we got, what the? We got, oh, we got clown, the, oh. My friend, oh, my friend's, uh, uh, Booyampi must have done this. Yeah, so, uh, the ability is, uh, I think it's party, something like that? And it gives you, uh, golden balloons. As you can see, this is the new mechanic, balloons. When you stand under them, they pretty much collect pollen, except for some reason they're leaving, so I think... Uh, I think maybe the cooldown might have happened, that's why, but yeah, there they go, floating towards the hive, and uh, they give me Balloon Blessing. So, uh, yeah. Though I don't think I have it. So there it is, 77,000 pollen, which is not really a lot. Um, but I mean, yeah, we got push room. Push room, so there's that. Um, I'm, I'm sorry if I'm screaming. I'm just very overwhelmed. There's so many things I have to show you guys. Um, but yeah, uh, I don't know when I'm gonna get my B equip case. I'm gonna leave the push rooms alone for now. Um, because we... We are going to go up here to show you guys... Holy... A, a rare push room? Whoa, okay. I didn't expect this. Uh, okay, I, I didn't expect that at all. Can you go away? Can you go away, Vicious B? Vicious B, I'm not in the mood, man. No, I'm not in the mood. Okay, well, that failed. But yeah, so, apart from the gifts, we also have a new area here next to the stump field, which uh, is uh, very much so... Is it the same size or is it bigger? I swear, I feel like it's the same... No, never mind. No, it isn't. It's much bigger. Yeah, yeah, no, no, it's much bigger. All right. Uh, but we have a new shop here, and uh, this is uh, the place where you um, where you meet the new bear. So let's go in here.
so cool. Did you guys hear that OST? Oh my god. On it really outdid himself, man. I am just beyond my words. This is insane. So this is the new bear, Dapper Bear. There he is. Um, and he's the one who sells you uh, planters. So these are the planters. They're different types of planters. So we have plastic planter. Uh, it grows in about two hours. Stores about 250k pollen. Harvest to collect random items and boost. We got uh, candy planter. It grows, so this one grows uh, faster in strawberry, pineapple, patch, and coconut field. Gives 10% bonus white pollen. Grants 20% motivating nectar. So I think I remember on it saying something. I, I'm not gonna post a screenshot, but I remember on it saying something about if you want to grind gumdrops for the gummy gummy boots, you could use this. We have uh, the planter of plenty, which is very very expensive a hundred trillion honey jesus alone grows in about 16 hours stores around one trillion pollen oh my god uh grants many bonus items including nanny berries wax and interpreting grows 50 percent faster and grants 50 percent more pollen on harvest in the pepper patch and the stump co stump coconut and mountaintop fields Gifted bees are 50% more likely to sip nectar from this. Grants 50% of all nectar types. Yeah, I can see why it's expensive. It pretty much... It, this is like... You can plant it anywhere you want. Uh, we got tacky planter. This grows in 8 hours. Okay. And we got pesticide planter. Okay. So this is like for if you want to grind, I guess, stuff like uh, radioactive stuff. But that's... Uh, well, I mean, yeah. That, that's really cool, though. I don't think you can talk to, uh, I don't think you can talk to Dapper Bear. I don't know, I remember him saying his quests are gone or something. Let's see. Hi, I like your hat and your boots too. I guess you could call me Snooty, but that's the only reason you got in. Appearances are everything, and our attire is more than skin deep. I take pride in how I present myself in my shop in my own way. So much pride that you could call me Dapper Bear. I've set up shop here in hopes of meeting creative bears, beekeepers, and bees who aren't afraid to be a little bold in a subtle sort of way, tending towards our, towards an aesthetic sense to unlock our, hmm, unique potentials. The mission is a little vague, but it should come together in time. For now, take this. A bee kick- Oh! So you have to go to Dapper Bear to get your bee clip case if you don't have it. Oh! I thought- I thought it was gonna be like last year where you, I think you had to do the first quest for Bee Bear, you got the Bee Quip, but no, you go to Dapper Bear, and that's how you get the Bee Quip case. Okay, a Bee Quip case. With this, you can equip Bee Quips to your bees. Bee Quips are accessories your bees can wear to improve their stats and even teach them new abilities. Every bee, no matter how small or unassuming, has the potential to stand out with the right Bee Quip. But I'll teach you all about that later. For now, I need to finish setting things up. But if you return throughout the winter event, I'll have some quests for you. Feel free to take a look at my planters. I'll teach you more about those later as well. Just know that the gist is, they're as helpful as they are neat looking. Sort of like me, and I'm guessing sort of like you. Place planters on flower fields and they'll automatically grow over playtime. If you leave the game, the planter will pause growing, but it will stay on the field and still be there when you return. As planters grow, they store pollen, they store pollen, prizes like treats, and crafting materials like waxes. And of course, nectar. Nectar is a special substance that grants temporary boost to the honey making of your hive. By standing on a field with a planter, your bees can visit can visit it to sift nectar. When they do, they gather a little bit of nectar and help speed up the growth of the planter. Placing planters on different fields is essential to gathering materials and nectar. But I'll have many quests to help explain them, explain it more in depth. For now, I'll give you some ticket planters for you to test this out. Some planters, like those ticket planters, can only be harvested once. But all the planters in, for sale in my shop can be reused endlessly. Now if you'll excuse me, I've got to keep prepping. Check in with you soon. So we got a bee cookcase case and three ticket planters. Um, so, yep. There it is, bee clip case. Hold accessories for your bees to wear. There we go. 
Uh, we got five snowflakes. We got two new items, honeysuckle. So automatically make makes bees instantly convert some pollen into honey when your bag becomes full as a cooldown 30 seconds and the world gig swiftly carries you and your bees back to your hive so kind of like a teleport tool uh we also have i believe let's scroll down oh oh okay so uh ironically we have two gingerbread bears so the old gingerbread bears have turned into aged gingerbread bears um, you can only get them, I believe, through Puppy Bee's reindeer antlers, if I'm not mistaken. Unless if they're unobtainable by that way, then in that case, there's no way to get them. And I have a gingerbread bear, so that's really good. Um, and here it is. We have three of these. So we have three paper planters and three ticket planters. Now, I'm not going to use my ticket planters because, uh, you can only use those, I believe, once. And I think what that means is you can't get them anywhere else. They give you tickets, a little bit of tickets, like I think 25, I'm not sure. But I'm not going to use them. Uh, so we have paper planters. So how about we... Uh, the grows in about an hour. I don't have that much time. Okay. Um, but yeah. Uh, so I guess this is like a first look into what Beesmas entails. So, um, yeah, I believe that is all for today. I'm sorry if this video was kind of a rushed one or one that's kind of chaotic. There's a lot to do in Beesmas, so, I, you know. Um, yeah, I mean, whatever. <laughs> um, do not fear. I, I'm not sure what to do. There's a lot of things I could do. Um, I think I could make a video separately. Uh, I mean... Maybe I'll do a video on like each of like the decorations and such. I'll probably do that so you guys can see all the decorations and all the different quests. Um, I'll most likely do that. So that will probably be the next video or possibly um, the video before the quest. Cause I don't know when the rest of the packs are releasing. They could be released this weekend. Um, they could be released sometime later. I'm not sure, but um, yeah. Um, so, yeah, partial business is here, guys. Partially, because not everything that we want is here, but it is here. So, yeah. Um, and I'm going to stand near my friend. So, uh, yeah. So, yeah. Um, yeah, I believe that is all for today. And uh, once again, here's my friend Death. I will leave his channel probably in the description and in the pinned comment. Um... But yeah, do check him out. He's making videos as well, and I think he'll make some B-Storm vids, so uh, do make sure to check him out. But yeah, anywho, thank you all so very much for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to give this video a like and subscribe for more videos. And do not worry, for this Beesmas, I will grind, and hopefully we'll be able to get a lot of goodies. Uh, so yeah, anywho, I will see you all later. Bye!